It's Ryan, and I'm back with another video that provides real evidence that God and the angels exist. Today I'm going to do an audio file of Victor that I recorded in 2000. The original video with captions was done in 2010. At that point I called it To Know Her, and you should still be able to find that one on Victor the Budgie's YouTube channel. This version will be better though, because today I'm going to do the quantum reversal. If you don't know what a quantum reversal is, I'll tell you a little bit later. But for now, I want to introduce the video I named Victor's Gift from Heaven. This is a fairly short one, when Victor was about one year old. The day I recorded the audio file, I brought home a female budgie and we named her Betty. In it, Victor was extremely excited and thankful, as you will see. But before I get into the video, I want to go over a few reasons why you should believe that my budgie videos are not something they taught them to say, and they really are connecting to a spiritual source which I prefer to call God and the angels. Those that have been following me for a while should know that by now. However, for the newcomers, I often get the question, how did you ever teach them to talk like that? All I can say is, I didn't. They just learn like any intelligent and sentient being might that has similar tools as us to be able to produce human speech. As a matter of fact, they're capable of learning our complete human vocabulary in a few weeks. Now that's super intelligent, and Danny proved it right after I got him a couple of years ago. So here are some reasons why you should believe that this is really something truly miraculous. Number one, if you get a chance, try and listen to some of the best talking budgies on the internet you'll most likely be able to tell that they are just mimicking what they've been taught. However, if there are ones out there communicating like Victor, Mailer, or Danny, I'd love to hear about them and possibly do a translation for The Guardian. Many budgies may have clearer vocalizations than mine, but that is because they have practiced what they say through mimicries they have been taught. For the most part, my budgies are saying these things for the first time and learning how to pronounce the word while they do it. All three of my budgies had a vocabulary of several thousand words and could communicate on any subject a human could. Number two, if you still don't believe that I did not teach them to say these things, you might reconsider if I could prove to you that not only can they make perfect sense in forward speech, everything that they say in reverse speech can be understood as well. So in actuality, not only are they speaking fluently in forward speech, but fluently in reverse at the same time. Okay, so some of you out there will say, well, that's pushing it, and they're too hard to understand in reverse. Yes, I agree. It takes a lot of practice to be able to understand them in reverse. But here's the kicker. When I speak to them during the recordings and reverse it, I'm also communicating in reverse, and our souls are connecting, having reverse conversations. I'm not just talking about a little phrase here and there either. There are numerous examples in all of the videos where I speak fluently in reverse. There's even a couple where I speak for two or three minutes at a time and you can understand most of what I say. So even if I could teach them to say all these things, which I didn't, it would be impossible to teach them and myself to speak in reverse the way we do. Number three. When you really listen to the captioned recordings, you're getting a true testimony from the budgies of how they are connected to God and the angels. All three of them have talked extensively about this connection in different ways. Number four, there's also the precognition and prophecy that is demonstrated by them. Victor talked about things that are happening now over 20 years ago. Mailer could answer questions and record them before they were asked and Danny could tell you what was going to happen in a video before it happened. All these things you can witness if you start off with presentation one in our forum. So these are just a few of the reasons why you should take this seriously. We have been told by the angels through the budgies that they are here not only to start a new religion from God, but protect humanity from pain and suffering in the future and help us spiritually evolve. Listen, I really don't want to put down the Bible because there's a lot of good in it, but much of it was written 
for the politics and culture at the time. Don't you think it's time that we got the truth from the ultimate source, which is God and the angels, who are willing to give us their passion-filled testimonies? So with no further ado, let's get on with what Victor says in this recording, and then we will listen to the captioned video. In the foreword he says, Tell me, what do you want me to say to know her? Victor has a day like heaven was today. I tell you, God is good to him. It is true, God is telling Victor I'm blessed. She's exactly that I imagine. And at least I can play with her. She'll talk fast. Yes, I need to clean up my SHIT in the cage. Can you open a door for a culture that she can listen? Yes, maybe you'll need to push her. She has fear. Tell me what you know it costs for a budgie. You're to say to them for sure, thank you, at the store. Will you do this? Tell me I'm best my Betty. So that was when he first met Betty, he said that. And then in the reverse part, he says, And love shall make God happy. I knew this love she has right now will mean a life of spiritual evolution. And it's something the angels carry with them when they reach out. The result is there will be much passion that will send us reminders. As we look at love, we will treasure. Today there may be people who stop fighting. And then I say in reverse, do we have to do this while reviewing the file here? And Victor continues, I know that Ryan shouldn't have a mission to file confession. Your mission is religious, you know. If you do, many will love to look at your life. I assume that Ryan hates fighting. I showed you a true admission and you'll know we always suggest we give more here. So now if you can open your mind spiritually and listen to this with headphones on, you might be able to hear much of what I translated there. What'd you say? Must be what? Are you happy now? You got a, somebody to play with? Tell me about Betty. I know that reverse part seemed pretty fast, but that's the nature of reverse sometimes. If you're listening to this on Facebook, I think there's a way to slow it down so you can hear it better as well. You may be able to do the same thing on YouTube. I provided the timers so that you can check either the forward or reverse time that he is saying these things so you'll be able to see that I've not changed the file in any way. So that was only one of the many I have of Victor still to do in presentations because I started off recording him with a cassette player and then I moved on to a digital audio recorder a little later. Before I completely finish this presentation I have another short one minute captioned reversal of Victor that I decided to throw in at the end. The last time I looked at this was in 2009 and I wanted to do a quantum reversal. I believe you will find it quite interesting. What about people? What about people? Yes, <laughs> 
This completes this presentation. Thanks for listening. If you'd like to join us, you can come to theangelscrolls.com and click on to the forum link at the top where we will be adding the newest presentations. Bye for now.